Yo, what's pumping people? So today's video is hopefully going to be a little bit more short. In my last video, I was discussing what is the best ecdy steroid, and I went over the three most popular ecdy steroids. Now, with these three ecdy steroids, we're going to take an arbitrary example of a 30-day cycle and see which one is the most effective. So, for a 30-day cycle of Muscle Empire Beta Ecdy Steroid, you would need one bottle, which be on the lower end $42, and on the higher end $55. Next up, we have Huge Nutrition Ectisterone, which again for a 30-day cycle, you would need one bottle, which would be uh, which would be 64 to 70 dollars, depending on whether or not you use an affiliate code. And then for Turkesterone, you would need anywhere from two to three bottles, depending on how many capsules you're taking per day. Because if you're taking four capsules per day and you multiply it by 30 days, you would need 120 capsules, which would be two bottles. But if you needed to take six capsules per day, well then it'd be six capsules times 30 days, 180 capsules. So you would need to take three bottles of this at $50 each. So if you were to look at it the same, evenly throughout, for a 30 day cycle, it would be about $150 for Tricasterone. It would be about $70 for Ectisterone, and for huge nutrition Ectisterone, and then about $45 for Muscle Empire Beta Ectisterone. And in my last video, I made a very important note that this ectisterone is made with uh, hydroxypopyl beta cyclodextrin, which is what makes tercasterone so so potent. And tercasterone is only 10% bioavailable, so it is extremely important for it to have the hydroxypopyl beta cyclodextrin complex in order to make it more bioavailable. So when we're looking at these two, just from a cost perspective, this one would cost about half as much as as Turkestron. Even though Muscle Empire is the cheapest, it is not the most effective, is what I think is most commonly noted, although it does still work. I think there is conclusive anecdotal evidence to indicate that huge nutrition ectisterone is far more potent than ectisterone. Now the real question is, is huge nutrition ectisterone more, more potent than Turkestron? And while the answer may be a little bit more inconclusive because tercesterone, in and of itself, milligram per milligram should be more potent than ectisterone, it is only 10% bioavailable, but also it is significantly more expensive. In this example, it is twice as expensive. But a lot of people, if they are a non-responder, do tend to respond better to tercesterone. That's why it's very important to factor in the price of the tercesterone versus huge nutrition ectisterone. I concluded that video by saying that there may be a reigning champ that supersedes both of these and all three of these. And that is this right here. The sister company of Gorilla Mine Intelligent Elephant uh, Beta Ectisterone. Now, what's really great about this one is, now, let's focus on just these two. I was finally able to get my hands on Ectisterone. It just came in uh, two days ago after the launch on Monday. And now let's take just these two. Because while Turkestrone is the most potent and the most effective, you just cannot dispute the high, the high upfront price of it. That's what makes Turkestrone so difficult to use. So, again, like I said in my last video, if you watched it, Turkestron, if you have the disposable income and want to go for better results, Turkestron is the way to go. But for your dollar, Huge Nutrition is probably your best bet because it also has the hydroxypropyl beta cyclodextrin complex. Now, of course, this intelligent elephant ectisterone also has the same super, super molecular inclusion uh, hydroxypropyl beta cyclodextrin complex. So, let's just assume that these two are both the exact same, which for the most part the label would indicate that they are. These are both 500 milligram capsules, and I assume they are both 250 milligrams of epistero and 250 milligrams of hydroxypropyl beta cyclodextrin complex. If we take just that evenly, both bottles have 60 capsules. Huge nutrition epistero is $70. With an affiliate code, you'd get it down to about $63, whereas Intelligent Elephant Ectisterone is $60, but with an affiliate code, it would be down to $54. So if we're to compare them side by side, 
just in price, Intelligent Elephant Ectisterone would reign supreme over Huge Nutrition Ectisterone. That's not the only thing to consider because as Derek has said several, several times, for Terkestrone, he could put the hydroxy uh, the hydroxypropyl beta cyclodextrin complex in the same capsule as the terkestrone and just ship it off like that, but that's not going to be as effective. Although they could produce a hundred times as more, they want to make sure that it's super molecularly infused together, and I think that is what intelligent elephant ectisterone achieves that huge nutrition doesn't. Now, I'm not 100% sure, but I've been paying attention to Huge Nutrition's ectisterone and their quantities when they restock and their frequency of restocking is far too high and far too common to think that they are properly complexing it the same way. Intelligent Elephant ectisterone, I'm not sure about how often it gets restocked and what quantity because the, the, the website was just launched this Monday, but from what I noticed, I think initially. Up front, they had about 25 to 50,000, I think closer to 30,000 in stock up front. They quickly sold out a good portion of it. All I know is that uh, the, and the in the later hours of Monday, after their website launched, they had about 17,000 quantities remaining. And as of today, I believe they had about 13 to 12,000 remaining. So they're not selling ridiculously fast. So with everything I just outlined, if you wanted to get Intelligent Elephant Ectisterone, this would be the best bang for your buck, by far, and it's also still available. But why I was saying that is because this one is more than likely not complex the same way as Huge Nutrition Ectisterone. I believe that Huge Nutrition Ectisterone is complex in an inferior way and Intelligent Elephant Ectisterone is the superior product. Not just in the pricing, but also in how it is being manufactured by uh, Gorilla Mind's sister company, Intelligent Elephant. So I wanted to outline all of that to you guys and I wanted to take you guys through what I personally am doing. Because I already completed my 30 day cycle of Muscle Empire Beta Ectisterone. The next step is a 30 day cycle of Huge Nutrition Ectisterone, which I am currently on my first week of. I will have my, my, uh, my review of Muscle Empire next week. And the week after that, I will have my first update of Huge Nutrition Ectisteroid. About two weeks after that, I will conclude my 30 day cycle, do my second update as well as a review of Huge Nutrition Ectisteroid. And then after that, I'm going to start my 60 day cycle of Terkestrone. Now, Terkestrone I expect to do for 60 days, but I do believe that it's where I'm going to yield the best results unless I am a non-responder, which I really hope I'm not. After that, I'm going to do potentially a six month cycle of Intelligent Elephant Ectisterone, which is going to more than likely be overkill, but I want to mainly, before I even consider the six month cycle, I want to compare them all side by side and notice the difference because I do think I will gradually notice a significant difference. And to give you guys a little preview, just this week that I've been taking this version of FDs down for about five days now, I am already feeling and feel like I've been yielding better results than I was on Muscle Empire Beta Ectisterone. With Muscle Empire Beta Ectisterone, I was taking anywhere from five to seven capsules per day. With Huge Nutrition Ectisterone, I'm only taking two capsules per day. And I can already tell and feel a difference where somehow despite me being in a higher caloric intake than I was with Muscle Empire, I'm actually gradually losing weight, about 0.2 pounds per day, which is very early to say, but it seems to be yielding pretty good results. But I'm going to keep you guys updated with this. I do think we have a new reigning champ with Intelligent Elephant Ectisterone. And as much as I want to try this out already because I'm very excited to try this out, I need to trust the process and test the difference between all these products because I want to be able to provide you guys with as much information with which Ectisterone is going to the best pick for you. So if you guys want to see my updates, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. Uh, I will keep you guys updated, and until next time, I will catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.